Hello everyone and welcome to the last episode in the vast let's play that we made with my friend Skudududus of Great Bohemia. <laughs> We're here to say goodbye to this let's play for a couple of reasons. Uh, I, I don't know which one is the most important. I would say uh, probably the version, <laughs> the diff <laughs> differences that we are encountering. But really, what happened is that uh, we had a ton of fun with this Let's Play. We did, right? Yeah, yeah, it was good. And uh, we got really far, but then real life struggles came over. I had university problems and, you know, had to focus on that. I started searching for a new job. And Mr. Scudododos, to be honest, is to blame more than me because he... Whoa. Yeah, he is because <laughs> he had a baby. And that's, 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 a, that's a different level of busy, you know. I'm like busy on an amateur level. Like, I'm, I'm busy with a glass of wine in my hand and, you know, my girlfriend on the side watching a movie, you know. But he's busy, like, sleeping four hours per day, you know, changing diapers with one hand and beating his wife with another. <laughs> That's the level of busy he is in. But, you know, the baby is doing fine, right? You, you managed to keep yeah. it alive for the first half a year. Yes, thank you. That's, That's an achievement, man. You've created a wife. And you took many more in, in the game. <laughs> But yeah, uh, so much time has passed between the time when we played uh, this game and the time that it is now. Actually, so Mr. Skurudulu said that we were like on version 1.6 when we started. Is that correct? It's, it's something like that. It was a long, long time. Yeah, ago. now it's version 2.5. It actually gave us a huge warning when, <laughs> when we started it. Like, you really sure you want to take this piece of old information and try to make it a new one? Oh yeah, well, uh, this is this is our goodbyes to the game. Like we had fun. We're not abandoning the cooperation. Actually, Mr. Scududus, now that his baby can breathe and actually, you know, move his hands and or its hands. Well, is it a girl? <laughs> yes, yes, she's a girl. Yeah, she's a girl. So uh, now that the baby is at least a bit sensibly living its own life, we decided that we're gonna get back to the cooperation that we had and play another different game. But first, we need to say goodbyes to this game. So, Abbasids have dwarfed us. <laughs> no matter what we did and how we joined, they, they became so big. Yeah, which I think we lost a, a crusade. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I like two the of them, us. actually. Yeah. But it was fun, you know. Yeah, Catholic faith is in ruins. Oh yeah, that's because you, you created the anti-pope. I remember that. And then you didn't know how to get rid of him. <laughs> that was fun. Yeah. But yeah, Bohemia and Francia and Lombardy, uh, we are standing strong. Though I can see that we didn't manage to save Sicily and no. south of Italy. Damn. I remember how... Uh, the Byzantium was slowly crumbling and we were just watching it like, that's not gonna happen! And then, then it was just it gone. And yeah. Yeah. Oh, and don't forget about the Welsh uh, England. Oh yeah, Welsh England. I can't even say the word. Loegir. Yeah. I think. Loegir. Loegir. <laughs> we had small pieces of Germany there. Fatheed <laughs> taking Spain. And we have a one province kingdom of, what is it? Burgundy. Burgundy, yeah. Yeah, one province King, kingdom. King Geoffroy the Shadow, which is an excellent name. Is he King Geoffroy the Shadow? Yeah, considering he's a one province king in the mountains, that's an excellent name, I think. It's actually pretty cool. I'm checking him, his kingdom, kingdom Burgundy is independent. Yeah. It tells me the difficulty is normal. Uh, <laughs> yeah, okay. For us, the difficulty is pointless. <laughs> so, who is it like really hard? Uh, there's Count Timotheus of Atalania. I don't even know what it is. County of Atalania. It's independent in uh, south of Turkey. Atalaya. Oh, yeah, I see. Difficulty is hard. But he's a Muslim. No, he's. No, yeah, he's Greek and Sunni. Oh. No, he's an uh, iconoclast. No, it's a Sunni. Is it? Yeah. Can't. Hmm. It's a Sunni. 
That one is probably the most difficult character in the game at this point. Hey, wait, did the Byzantium Empire survive? I didn't even know that. Yeah, yeah, it died in, uh, like, Crimea, didn't it? Yeah, in Crimea. Just... <laughs> That's cool. Who's the leader? Basilius Ioannes of the Byzantium Empire. Difficulty relatively easy. Well, I wouldn't claim that being next to the Abbasids. You know, that's probably not the right thing to say. And there's Nubia and Abyssinia. Yeah. And there, there's Finland and Kyrgyz. It's actually, uh, essentially like a group of Catholic provinces in like the steppe of Russia. Like modern day. Is that modern day Russia? I don't even know. Where? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. it is. It is. Catholic. That's really weird. <laughs> I like how we we have Catholic and then there are Slavic and what is this? Catholic? Fraticelli. Oh my god, Fraticelli is really strong. Yeah, it's all of flight. England, Wales, France. Yeah. I remember we had okay. huge problems with, with the Fraticelli revolts. revolts. Yeah. I completely forgot about it. Man, it was good. It was good. So anyway, uh, we are here to say goodbye to this game. Uh, we're sorry that you guys that waited for this so long would just get this one last episode, but we, we at least wanted to make, you know, like a goodbye to the game. Yeah. To, to close it off, saying that uh, there were moments where we nearly resurrected it, but just life is too too hard and this, this game is just, you know, it's a long thing playing a yeah. campaign like this. We got all the way to 1087, which is like, what, 300 years, maybe? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, when do you start? Is it like seven... Seven, six, yeah, um, and and we achieved a lot. And right now, what we're thinking about is starting a new let's play, uh, one that you know we will be in together, and that we can continue every Sunday recording together. Uh, but we're yeah. not sure what to do it with. Uh, what are the options, man? Uh, just paradox games, probably better. Yeah, we're thinking about Crusade Kings two. Plus, with CK2+, plus, you know. But the problem is it hasn't been updated for the latest version. What we have to do, if we ever make it work, we just, you know, ban all updates to the game. Just just mm -hmm. manually stop them and forbid them. Because holy crap, did they screw us over so many times. <laughs> We're also thinking about uh, Darkest Hour, making, making a let's play of that, like a multiplayer, together. Uh, maybe First World War, <laughs> France and UK. <laughs> Dying at the Somme next to each other. That would be so awful. But, you know, that, that's usually how it works. The, the Wow, what is it called in English? In Czech, it's like, we call it, actually, the battle in the history books that I had in school was called the Meat Grinder at River Somme. Wow. It's just, it's, I thought it was just the Battle of the Somme. Yeah, but we actually call it like this, the Meat Grinder at the Somme. Yeah. Lions but, led by donkeys. <laughs> well and we're also thinking about some some other possibilities we we will have to discuss it but we're welcoming any suggestions from your side we're willing to check anything out see if we can do something maybe uh, out of the box but so far you know it's uh, we're thinking about these so let us know what you would like and if we play CK2 plus I kind of like the setup that we had in the beginning you know the Byzantium counts. That was actually yeah, really fun. I, yeah, I like that. We might do that again. But as we said, uh, we're closing off this Let's Play due to version problems, and exactly the same thing is going to happen to the CK2 Plus because yeah. we just th there's no way. Like we might have made this one work if the conversion worked. I think that the world would just fall apart in in a yeah, matter of days. I, don't, I, I think it would crash if we actually loaded into the game. I don't think it would. Yeah, it's just, it's DLCs that when even out that are active etc yeah but with ck2 plus that is just, we can't even start the game like no. it's it's so awful so we will either have to uh, you know restart that one or choose a different game so i guess uh, that's enough to chat do you want to say something as an yeah. ending to this game well it, it was it was fun we ended up coming out from were we single county camps yeah. Well, uh, yeah. And I never did get my son back. I don't think. 
I don't think so either. Nah, st- you took it off me and I never got it back. <laughs> I won't forget that. Okay, well, you can you can punish me for that in the next game. <laughs> like, if I play France and you play Great Britain, you will not send those reinforcements when <laughs> Germany no. overtakes me. Never forget Meissen. <laughs> what was it, Meissen 876? <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, this is Alpha Pi Omega and Mr. Scudo Dulu saying goodbye. Goodbye, everyone.